non-identical twins, also known as fraternal twins or dizygotic twins, develop in a fundamentally different way from identical twins. While identical twins arise from a single fertilized egg that splits, fraternal twins result from two entirely separate fertilization events. In a typical menstrual cycle, a woman's ovaries release one egg. However, in the case of fraternal twins, the woman's ovaries release two separate eggs during the same ovulation cycle. This phenomenon is called hyperovulation. It can occur naturally or be induced medically. Specific genes, such as GDF9 or BMP15, can cause the woman's ovaries to release multiple eggs. This trait runs on the maternal side. A father can carry the gene, but it won't make him have twins. It will make his daughter more likely to have twins. As women get older, specifically in their 30s, their fertility drops gradually, but their chance of twins increases. This is because the body produces more FSH to kickstart the aging ovaries, which can accidentally overstimulate them into releasing two eggs. Immediately after stopping hormonal birth control pills, the ovaries may wake up with a surge of hormones, occasionally releasing multiple eggs in the first few cycles. This phenomenon is known as the rebound effect. Other fertility drugs, like Clomid or Letrozole, are designed to stimulate the ovaries, which frequently cause hyperovulation. The two released eggs travel together, waiting for fertilization at the ampulla of the fallopian tube. Each of these two eggs is fertilized by a different sperm. Each of the two fertilized eggs then implants separately into the wall of the uterus. From this point forward, each embryo develops independently. Each twin develops its own placenta and amniotic sac. That's why it's called dichorionic diamniotic twins. Sometimes the two placentas can fuse together if they implant very close to each other, but they remain genetically distinct and functionally separate in terms of their blood supply. Unlike identical twins, fraternal twins are no more genetically alike than any other siblings born at different times. They share, on average, about 50% of their genes, just like regular brothers or sisters. Because they originate from two separate eggs fertilized by two different sperms, fraternal twins can be of the same sex, two boys or two girls, or different sexes, one boy and one girl. This is the easiest way to definitively know if twins are fraternal without a DNA test. Just like any other siblings, fraternal twins may look very similar, or they may look quite different from each other, resembling other family members. The tendency of hyperovulation to release multiple eggs during ovulation can be inherited. This is why fraternal twinning often runs in families, typically on the mother's side. Because fraternal twins come from two different eggs and two different sperms, it's biologically possible for them to have two different fathers, if the mother had relations with two different men within a short ovulation window. This rare biological phenomenon is called superfecundation. In extremely rare cases, a woman can get pregnant while already pregnant. This results in twins who were actually conceived weeks apart. A phenomenon called superfetation. If you like the 3D medical animations, don't forget to subscribe. Thanks for watching.